It's Wednesday night and you know what that means. It's live, laugh, love Wednesdays with Ashton Stream I time, I do. How are you? Mixer. How was your weekend? <laughs> Hope you are having an amazing day. Hello, sorry about that. Um, I had nudged the knob. I touched a knob and the knob was wrong. And I had not noticed that the knob was wrong because I was too busy trying to fix my capture card because the capture card wasn't working. And I didn't think about the knobs. I forgot to consider the knobs. Oh my God, that is a massive spider up there. Dead Island 2's here. Anyway, hello. Sorry about the knob, the knob nudging. Um, thank you for the blip, Stephen. And thank you to Fluffy Ruffs and Sprout Stuff for resubscribing. Love you to have you here. Um... Yeah, I had a good weekend. It was a bit busy, got a bit drunk, and then spent all day playing. Most days just played Astro Bot, um, if I'm being honest. That's pretty much all I did all weekend. Um, so I'm excited to be playing more. I finished it last night. So I finished Astro Bot last night, apart from the like super master level that's like the final end game thing. Um, at the moment that is like uh, one that like you just do the whole thing in one go I uh, haven't done that yet I tried last night but after having spent like what was a good hour and a half on one of the other like challenge levels I decided it just wasn't for me today so um, yeah the, the rub deck wasn't even in the super mega challenge level it was just in a regular challenge level it made me want to actually rip my own eyes out and just walk into the sea that flipping duck, man. I, I feel so much rage towards that duck. I had to Google. I had to Google a tip on how to do it because I could not figure it out. It was driving me, me, driving me mental. Anyway, enough of that. We'll talk about the nice things about Asher, but we're going to dive into the beginning today. So we're going to start from the beginning. And then if we want to, maybe a, maybe you can watch me attempt the super master level. I'm sure nothing will go wrong with that. Um... But I think we should just get into it. I think we should just get into it, don't you? Let me unmute the PlayStation. Oh, if you hear any funny noises coming from me, the this game uses the the inbuilt microphone so much that I had to turn it down when I was playing yesterday because it was so loud. Because I was playing it like this, <laughs> and I felt like I was getting screamed at. Um, but yeah. So if you hear any funny noises coming from me. It's the controller, all right? Um, but we're going to start again. Look at that, 300 out of 300. There's a crown on my head because I'm the best gamer around. Um, but we're going to jump into it from the beginning. That level took me three hours. The duck one. Oh, God. Don't even, it took me so long. It's not even funny. It does. It uses the PS5 capabilities so well. Like, mm -hmm. I just kept thinking to myself, like, this is the only time where I feel like this 
co this controller gets the full use that so you get to actually see what it could do and it's so crazy the last one took three hours oh god good i look forward to losing my mind at that then um it's so crazy that none other ps5 games have used it quite like how this game uses it um it does drain my battery life on the controller so that is the only downside to how much it's used um, Stephen, thank you for resubscribing. 63 months of triple jump. So many months of laughs and entertainment. It's been so wonderful being sub to this awesome channel. Proud to be supported here and on Patreon. Thanks for the laughs and good times and hashtag good vibes. Here's to many more. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you for 63 months. That's crazy. This alien is fisting our PlayStation 5. And he stole it. He stole the motherboard. Or the mother chip. I can't remember what, what it's called. I think the... Either way, that little thing that little thing got stolen. And all those Astro bots have dead they're all dead now. That's how Astro Bot starts with no Astro bots because they're all dead. They're all dead. They all they all died. I'm so sorry to tell you. Hey Div, how's it going? It's our boy, the saviour of gaming. When I got my PlayStation 5 back yesterday, I need to start up on Star Wars Outlaws. What's been purchasing Baldur's Gate 3? Nice! Star Wars Outlaws is next on my list now. I've finished Astro Bot. Um, I'm gonna dive into Star Wars Outlaws before I. Uh... Oh no, you sad controller. Before Plucky Squire comes out in uh, a week. What else is coming out soon? Uh, October we've got um, Assassin's Creed and other stuff. There he is, our boy. Oh no, the spaceship. It's broken. Look at him, he's so cute. Oh, I love this, love this little guy. Love him. Wee! I oh, know I play this game. Played like fifteen hours of it. I'm enjoying this game so much. I know it's so good. Plucky Squires on PlayStation Plus as well. Is it? Have they announced that? I didn't. Re Did I know that? Feels like I knew that, but also feels like I didn't. Is it coming to like extra? Is it really on PlayStation Plus? Then I'll be lying to me. Then I'll be lying to me, Coffee Goblin, or I'll, I'll find you. I'll have you. I'm gonna go back and play Gollum and finally finish it. Oh no, oh no. Unfortunately, that copy of Gollum's gone. It's gone. We'll never see it again. Sorry. Sorry about that. It's actually, it, it's gone. It was stolen by the bin. The bin stole it. Day one on PlayStation Plus. Oh, sick. We're going to the Gorilla Nebula. Well, that's very exciting that it's day one on PlayStation Plus. Somehow I missed that. Steve, thank you for gifting a sub to Coffee Goblin. That's 1,262 gifts on the channel. That is crazy. Gosh, they want on PlayStation Plus. That is cool. We're going to the Ski Garden. A few levels in this game have like really, really fun um, gimmicks, and I don't know if we'll get to it today. If we, I can't remember if it's on this level or this nebula or the other nebula. But there's one where you're like you shrink into be a mouse size, and you have to do like mouse size things. And it's very, very cute. Very cute, very demure, very mindful of cool things. Some mingos. Bot, bot. Get out of here, loser. I'm flipping Astro Bot. I'll beat you up. Hey, I think I'm doing well. Thank you very much. How are you? There's a boy here. We'll rescue you, little bot. Don't seem in very much danger. 
kick him in his ass, and then he goes in what I like to call the hot tub in the controller, and you can toss him around in the hot tub. When they're all in there, the more you collect, they all just kind of end up in the hot in the hot tub that I call it, and I uh, I do like how much it just looks like they're all chilling in the hot tub. He's fine. He's the first one in the hot tub. The water's warm. The water's clean. You've not got to share it with anyone. In the hot tub you go. Two bots chilling in the hot tub. Five feet apart because they're not gay. Damn it. Hot tub controller for the hot tub stream. Absolutely. Have they fixed a typo in one of the messages yet? There's a typo in one of them. I haven't seen it. But then again, I didn't notice it the first time around. So, do you know which one? Scored a goal, bitch. Kicked his ass. The music in this game is so good. So, when, like, it's a, um, a level themed around a PlayStation IP or, like, a franchise, they do, like, Astro Bot remixes of, like, those songs. And the God of War one is so good, as is the Horizon one. Like, the Her Astro Bot's version of the Horizon theme is just, Forbidden West theme especially, is so good, man. Batman fan Drew, thank you for resubscribing. And same with Alien Sweat Hands. Happy Wednesday. I should happy Wednesday to you as well, my friend. Uh, and Sean Wallace, thank you for also for subscribing. Oh, you're very privileged to have you all here. Um, free DLC coming, exactly. Yeah. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. This game is just so good, man. Oh, no, look. A long box. Also, one thing I'm absolutely obsessed with is the, um, the like, debt. So they never say like their names, they're like official names. So it gives me it gives like oh um Halloween costume knockoffs that absolutely cracks me up. Tooled up mechanic being ratchet is so good. There's like other ones like where it's just so like not legally distinct versions of them that it cracks me up. And I feel like that might be one of my favourite parts about this game. When you take the bots back to the crash of the vessel, there's a typo in the message title. That's so funny. We'll look out for it. A secret level. Hey, you leave Rivet alone in there. She's a lovely lady. Yeah. Lombax lady. Ashton Wednesday hype train. Ha! <laughs> Thanks for the hype train, guys. Whoa! Batman fan Drew, thank you for gifting five subs. So excited it's not even come through yet. Mm -hmm. um, they went to Autumn Blossom 2018, uh, Commie Spriggan, Gangrel 76, El Nerico, and Tori Tan. Thank you so much for him. Addy, thank you for mm -hmm. gifting two subs as well. Or one sub, sorry. It confused me because there was a second number. Um, that went to Jormaru. Jo wow, thanks so much, guys. Getting the flipping hype train. Hype train in honor of Astro Bot, of course. That's why we're all hyping right now. For the light of our lives, Astro Bot. I'm gonna have to like realize I don't need to collect all these coins because um right now I'm trying to collect coins in my save so I can like get all the rest of the collectible bits and pieces, but um I don't need to do that here, so we can just power through. Hey! Give me that back, you bitch. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. <gasps> I didn't know this was here. I wonder how I got that the last time. Get out of here, loser. I fell. That thing's alive. How haunting is that? Right to kill it. It was alive and then we killed it. But it's fine because it's Astro Bot. 
hyped in honor of, your, of streaming on your stream day at the right time. I know. I'm like, I'm no need to brag, but I might be the hardest working woman in show business. Look at us go. We want to flip in. We get puffy. I accidentally hit the flamingo. Sorry. Yeah. Chew, flip, and chew. Chew, flip, and chew indeed. Oh my god, guys. Do you know who is in this game? That bitch off of Space Channel 5 or whatever it's called. What is it? Space Channel 5? Space Channel 9? What's that flipping game? You know, the kiss, kiss, chew, chew, chew. Whatever her name is. What's her flipping name? I don't even care. That bitch is what I, what I refer to her as. She's in one of the like bonus levels and I was like, how dare you be here? What made you think you could show your face here again? You cow? What's her name? Ulala, yeah. Yeah. She's here mocking me with a silly, silly being part of Astro Bot ruining my day when I saw her. I was like, how dare you be here? This is my game. What makes you think you have a right? Flipping ooh la la. I'll fight her. Yeah. Fist fight. Ashton finishing Space Channel 5 when? TTJ Cheeky Ben. Never. Thank you for the blips, but never. I'd rather die. And I would if I tried to finish that game. To be honest, I don't think it was entirely my fault. I think partially it was because the game isn't very clear. And also partially because um, we were playing on an emulator where it didn't flip in. Um, it wasn't It wasn't right. It was wrong. It was wrong. It was just plain wrong, actually. Uh, it's, it's the truth. I take it out with the Zoe they put her. That's true. I've already got beef with them for that level that they uh, they designed. So, what's one more beef to add to the pile? A barbecue. Get out of there! And we've done it. Our first level. How cute was that? And look, all of the flowers are so happy for us. I was going to bust a move. Right, I always mess this up. Every single one of those I've messed up. Almost every single one. So I'm quite glad I didn't mess it up. If anyone's going to finish it, it would be Peter. That's true. I think Peter des deserves his punishment for making me do that. To finish it. Let's go to the ice cream land. Creamy Canyon. Creamy Canyon. Here we are in the in the creamy canyon, the delicious creamy canyon. Some little bears here. Oh look, we can take a picture. Smile. Don't enter anyone's creamy canyon without consent. Gross! Banned! How dare you? <laughs> That's awful. You should be you should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> also, that was really funny. Really funny ten out of ten joke, to be honest. Can't even be mad about it. Hey, give me that guy back. I've also realizing that I don't know um who like I don't recognize that many people and I keep being like, oh, it's just some guy. And then I have to like really look and be like, oh, it's that, <laughs> it's him. It's him off of that thing. Ugh. Got a jigsaw puzzle piece. 
Give me that guy. Look at that, we missed. I, oh, I missed this one the last time too. Oh, I remember where he is. I think. I think I remember. Oh yeah, it's down here. We're gonna find our other boy. What are you doing down here? Get in the hot tub now. The homing hot tub. The homey hot tub. Have I drawn some boobs in the cream yet? I haven't drawn any boobs in the cream. Next time we come across somewhere with lots of cream, we'll draw some boobs. I think I've already decreamed this too much. Scoop, scoop. I guess I could draw a pair of tits in this cream. Oh, you're ruining the you're ruining the boob cream. Hold on. Oh, that might be too small. Damn it! This flipping ladybug. Ruining the boob cream. Got your ass, pig. Party. So, just in case anyone does decide to play this later, anyone, a little fun little tip. You can uh, grab this pig, and if you throw him at this um, seal over there, secret ending. Secret and then takes you to the mirror dimension. How very exciting. We got him. That guy's name's Nigel. And the other guy's name is Marcus. Stop it. There's a little pro gamer tip with me yet. Just a little, this is your walkthrough guide. Um, clear two spaces in your inventory. These guys are fun. I don't know why we even have beef with these guys. They just, they don't even do us damage. They're just kind of... Look at them bonking around out here. I need one of you to go that way, please. No, no. Fight for my life out here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, piss. It bounced off me. Right. Right. God damn it. Okay. Come to rescue you, Shanice. Make two rooms in your hot tub for the Astrobots to go in. Exactly. If you make two rooms in your hot tub, you'll be able to... Um, to fit in Shanice. Let me... We're doing up there! Get back here! God, this is a nightmare. I remember being this annoying before. We'll just wait here and... Okay, missed a few coins, but that's alright. Oh my god, he died. <laughs> that guy died. That was really sad, huh? Oh, I forgot we were going to make tits, weren't we? I forgot. Oh, oops. I forgot about making tits. Making room in the boobs. Get out of that ice cube. Oh, crap. We missed one. Damn it. We're going to have to go back and find it. Hmm. Do I remember where this guy was? I think maybe he's down there. Yeah, he's down there. It's like, help me. Help me. Monk. Here he is. What's up, homie? It's you from that game. <laughs> I know what game he's from. I know what game he's from. I'm not going to tell you, but I know what game he's from. So, if anyone told you I didn't, they're telling lies because I do know what game he's from. 
It's from Call of Duty. <laughs> Astro boob. Very good. They keep telling me you don't know what game is from. Well, I don't know who's, who's telling you that because I do. It's from Fortnite. Yeah, Fortnite is always a good shot. You probably like more like that. Every time. I miss time every time. Um, yeah, like, I know what game he's from. From Astrobot. Ovs. He's obviously from Astrobot. Duh. Oi. Give me that flipping. Give me that puzzle piece, you UFO bitch. Let's do the Aztec trial. You know, I know who they are. Exactly. I just don't want to spoil it for you. I want to let you guys figure out who they are. You don't, I you know, don't want it to be me to figure everything out for you. You're, you're big boys and girls and others, so you can figure it out. Should you need to. No doxing the little bots. Exactly. So you guys get it. You guys understand why I wouldn't uh, want to tell you who they are. Or what game they're from. And if I do it for anyone else, it's just because, like... If I say, oh, that's so-and-so from, so like, this game, then you'll know that it's just because I I just feel like that's not as exciting as that other game that these other guys are from. Ass tech truck. <laughs> God damn it, we're going to have to draw an ass in the in the grass. Your ass is grass. First it was boobs in the cream, and now we're going to have to draw some an ass in the grass. So one of these vibrates on the controller, by the way. But I just tend to just push forward and then they eventually opens one. Four, 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 four. Oof, 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 oof. So good, man. Oof. Yoink. Do we then get dick in the stick? Yeah, 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 yeah. Also available. Coming next, it's Dick in the Sticks. Come on then. Go on then. Get flipped, loser. Oh, damn it. This guy's name is... Uh, Bruce. Why is it that I can never think of names for people? <laughs> Like, what is that about? Oh my god, it's Crosh Bonky Ponks. Crumbs, crumbs, bumps, bumps. There he is, look. It's a fox. Everyone, that well famous fox. Crumbs, crumbs, bumps, crumbs. That's him. And we're also lucky that he's here. How the hell do I get up there? Oh well. Famous fox, you mean Basil Brush? You're so, you're so right. He is the most famous fox of all time. The most famous fox is Basil Brush, and anyone who tells you otherwise is lying. Crash Banuka, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crash Banuka is the second most famous fox. I would piss. I would say. What's that flipping? Come here. secret passage so this i'm not going to do it now because i'm going to end the level but if you find one of these it takes you to a different dimension where there's bonus levels i said bonus and not bonus so don't even think about it i know funny move for this stream eh bonus bonus
Look how disgusting that looks. The goo. I hate it. You hate to see it. You really hate to see it. The babies try to run away, but you have to kill them as well. Because if the baby lives, it will grow to be a big one again, and we can't have that happen. You must kill all of them. The babies have to die too! Bonus levels are for when we draw dicks in the sticks. Lobby's fighting for his life, and I'm not helping even a little bit. Boing! Oh. No! Have it back, loser! But the baby ones run away, look. And then they then they self-combust. Because they're so scared of Astrobot. His might his mighty powers of Astrobot. Famous across the world. Free Marianne! I'm screaming on the inside. Well that's alright, but it's just on the inside. As long as it's not bothering anyone, you know. Boing. God, we're so flipping good at games. Look at us go. This is a team effort, everyone. It's just so flipping satisfying. Zelda. You know him. Look, it's Zelda. He's just shake, shaking cheeks at me. Why is he trying to grind on me? Zelda. Yes, we had. just thinking to myself i was like i know that that's not true but i just think it's funny because people are gonna think that i think that that's zelda <laughs> it's zelda there he is shaking cheeks <laughs> babies must die too I'll leave an angry comment under the board. Ha! I'll just delete it. I'm not afraid. We've got Conk, Bonte, Conk, and we've got Zelda, and also like a bunch of random guys. If Zelda's not the name of the hero, why is it called The Legend of Zelda? Such a good question. Zelda, for, yeah, from Fortnite. Yeah, exactly. You know him, it's Zelda from Fortnite. Bonus levels. Bonus levels. Eh. Give me this. Got it. I messed up the first time when I did it and I had to go back and get it. And I was really upset about it. Oh no, a gorilla! It's King Kong! It's Godzilla! The gorilla! Monkey? 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 
idiot. What are you doing up there? Get down! Why can I not hit this guy? Get down! Just and Bob the Builder. I think you mean that Donkey King off of Fortnite. I think I think you're probably right. I'm sorry. It's the first one I haven't known what they are. That's President Kong. He's from another country. <laughs> he uh, really he values diplomacy over everything else. Manganut Boing A new power up. It's the dog power up. The dog power up. And a woof. 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 Die, idiot. Get out of here. Stop doing graffiti. Even if you're very good at it. That just really freaked me out. The music. I've not heard this before when I was playing without headphones. But someone in the in the music is going, what did you say your name was? And I was like, hello? Just in a regular voice. Because every time it's like, I am Astro Bart. But that's just some guy. That really freaked me out. <laughs> I didn't like it. Don't do that again, Astro Bot. You're rude. Baskets. Hoops. Yeah, my name is Ash, that's true. I should have just told the nice man that that was my name. Got to clean up this place. Right. And then we just throw it into the abyss. And it's someone else's problem. God, that music's really freaking me out with that guy's voice. What did you say your name was, sir? Who are you and what are you doing in my Astrobot game? My name is Astrobot. So true. If. Good. No. Those guys are so annoying. Ugh. I thought I heard a cat, but I think I made it up. Die. Die. Uh. No. Enough is enough. Something in my eye. Yay, coins. This guy, we just, just like try and ram ourselves up inside of him until he explodes, which I feel like is very, very cool of us. Very cool of us to do, you know?
What are you saying? What do you? What's wrong with? What do you mean, pardon? Look at Snoopy. It's cool, cool Snoopy. It's just that guy Snoopy. You know him from the from the from the the comics and no the puppet. No, that's pads. I'm thinking of um. Sooty, that's who I'm thinking of, <laughs> not Snoopy. But well, I didn't mean Snoopy, but uh, I was thinking of Sooty, and I know that now. Oh, I know now that that is wrong. Sooty, Sooty off of Sooty and Sweet. <laughs> famous, <laughs> famous dog, the most famous dog. Is Sooty a dog? I can't trust myself now. We robbed the building now. <laughs> Actually, but that's a lovely ghost gem. I can't wait. You want to shove myself inside it? <laughs> I don't think any of our cozy games have remained cozy and completely normal for like the entire time, you know. Ah! Get out of here! Moira! Oh dear. Sooty's a bear, that's so true. Sweet was a dog. Ah, that's what I'm thinking of. I'm the mix between Snoopy and Sweep the dog from Sooty and Sweep. <laughs> that's who that that's how that guy is, this guy. That's that's who that that hat dog in the hat is. It's Snoopy and Sweep. Whichever one you you know, you feel more connected to, I guess. Boing. I do wish that man would stop asking me what my name is. Why, why, does, he, why does he want to know, you know? It's none of his flipping business. Oh. I found Parappa. Sorry, who's Parappa? I don't know who you're talking about. Uh, who the hell's Parappa? I only have, I only have Sno Snoopy. Look, I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna get fired for this joke. He wants to steal my identity. You're so right. You're so right. That's Snoopy the dog. Yeah, exactly. You get it. You get it. Cause of termination is over committing to the bit. <laughs> now we're saving the red Power Ranger. We've got the red Power Ranger, Snoopy the dog, and three random people. Certainly missed a coin. Boy, oi, oi. I'm like a flipping pinball. Which Red Power Ranger? The one in prison for fraud or the one that's in prison for murder? The fraud one, I think. The fraud one. Feels less bad. Oh god, don't miss this again. Okay, two out of three ain't bad. <laughs> Absolutely nailing this. We're speed in this game right now. Let's do, let's do the uh, retro rampage. Who wants some? A bunch of retro rabbits? Have it. We did it! And we unlocked. 
Some ginger guy. Ginger guy from a game we all know. It's um, the karate kid. It's the karate kid. Obviously. The mighty murdering power fraudsters. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> That's Jaden Smith as the karate kid. Or that TV show Cobra Kai, which I've never watched, but I think it had that guy who played Hannah Montana's brother in it. I hate these levels. Another pop my pop culture knowledge is on point. Thank you. I know. I'm so good at. Ugh. At one point, playing one of these levels, I said to myself. If I wanted to play Super Monkey Ball, I would have played Super Monkey Ball because I was getting so mad. Ugh. He's that guy from Concord, right? <laughs> Indeed. That is him. Okay, we don't actually need to get all the coins, actually. It's just your, your, your brain talking, but we don't actually need to get them all because... Okay, okay, okay. Uh. My Aardvark! Look, it's Astro Cat. Astro Cat, you know? There he is. It's Ember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's fight a flipping monkey. We're gonna fight an endangered species right now. That's what we're gonna do. for a monkey and he better be big and he better be ready to die because I'm on the hunt for an endangered species to murder a gorilla's endangered species I suppose one as big as King Kong is Clara probably is definitely a an endangered species you know because it's so big I thought it was Garfield Easy, easy mistake to make. Like Snoopy and Sooty, you know. Easy to get them confused. Get out of here, loser. Get out of here, loser. Where's that monkey, then? Mighty Chewy, you will see how flipping mighty you are. Where are my hearts? Oh, I almost overshot it then. Come here, you pussy. Sorry about that. Stiddy Kong. <laughs> Sup, Daddy Kong? Let's do it. Your monkeys don't scare me. I'm Astrobot, bitch. Boing. <laughs> don't fall off the edge. It'll be really embarrassing. Blind this guy. Huh? 
have it. Are you ready to get blinded? Because I'll flip and do it. I did give him pink eye. Two cases of pink eye. Think of the conjunctivitis you're going to have in the morning. Idiot. You're going to wake up and your eyes are going to be so gooey you're not even going to be able to open them. What are you going to do then, huh? Have to get a warm flannel to get it all off. Alright, we're going to have a biting. That seems very rude. Go see a dentist about it, idiot. <laughs> oh. I'm fine, I have three hearts. And you have no teeth now. Kill this guy. People of Metropolis, worship your new god. My name is Astrobot, and I am your savior today. I took that endangered monkey and I knocked all of his teeth out and blinded him. You're welcome. Look, it's um that guy from um it's Goku. It's Goku and his his monkey mate. We're off. Me, Goku, <laughs> the monkeys. <laughs> it's Black Myth Wukong. So right. Oh, I said no banana. Bit of a ape escape for all you enthusiasts out there. All you fans of Goku. Proof is I said they could make a neat ape escape game. Not wrong. Now we get to be Goku. Great. And we're gonna kill these monkeys. We're gonna kill these monkeys that they never even were real. Yeah. Flipping it. Got your ass, monkey bitch. Yeah, the apes have escaped from Goku and we have to get them back for Goku. Because he loves monkeys. These monkeys are so annoying, man. They keep escaping. If only the word escape rhymes with monkey. Mon monkey runkeys. The, the runky monkeys. I'm sure if there's a game in there somewhere, you know. I'm sure that we can think of something. That's like the word monkey or li li limp limp chimps. Hmm, I wish something rhymed with monkey that was also had the word like did something to do with escaping. Oh well. Guess that's why they never made a game like this because they couldn't find a way to make the uh, title catchy. It's a shame. Probably would have been a very well loved game. Bunky monkey, I mean, yeah, I guess that kind of works, but it's not super catchy, is it? Oh, well, I'm sure they'll find something for Goku to, uh, to do. Come here, you flipping loser. Funky escapey monkey. Yeah, escapey monkey. Simeon imprisoning. Yeah, 
but what's it'd be the opposite i guess in prison we are imprisoning them in a cage so yeah that could work you could work with that Yours is a spin-off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Simeon Liberation. Yeah. Maybe they can make a game like this. Crazy no one's ever thought of this before. Until until it was first done in Astro's Playroom. I mean, Astro Bot. Astro's Playroom is the other one. Crazy. Crazy, huh? Well, I'm glad it took us... You know, we've come up with it now, so... I'm sure someone else will have as well. Come here. Come here. You silly bitch. Come here. Got him. Baboon free doom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be baboon no free doom, I guess. Oh, I suppose I suppose if you're going for the escaping part, yeah, right. Free doom makes, makes sense. Baboon free doom. I like Baboon Free Doom. It's good. Come here. Baboon be good. <laughs> free, free her the gorilla. Yeah? All very good suggestions. All very good suggestions. Someone will have to make this game now. Goku in Free Baboon Free Doom. R.I.P. Harambe. Oh my god. R.I.P. Harambe, you would have loved Baboon Free Doom. Look! Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> I'm making myself laugh now. I don't even know if this is bit is funny. I'm, I'm just making myself laugh. Flip. He got squished by a rabbit. That is what that matters, you're right. Really, there's no one in the in the chat and I'm just doing this for myself. I just pretend like I'm streaming and make make it up. Just so my boyfriend doesn't ask me to make dinner. I'm like, can't, I'm streaming. And I sit in here for hours pretending to be talking to chat. Playing a game. Come here. Come here. Come here, you dickhead. Sonic is so Sonic is so fast! Sonic the Hedgehog! I use the voices in my head. Yeah. I've got chat GPT to generate a realistic looking Twitch chat. Actually, if it was a realistic looking Twitch chat, I'm sure it would be much more horrible than it is. Rescued ship part! Alright, Astro. Chill out. It goes in the hot tub with all of the monkeys. Hey, hey, we're the monkeys. People say we monkey around. We're too busy singing. Is that the line? I don't know. I can't remember. You heard it, guys. We're unrealistic. You are. You are unrealistic. You're too nice. Too polite. Too not sexist. If you were, if you were real, <laughs> if you guys were real, you'd be much worse. <laughs> Thank God you're not real. Yay! Let's see if they do the spelling error. Oh, we've got to fix this bit first, so then we might see it. This game is the only reason I regret getting rid of my PS5. Understandable, it is a very good game, and I'm enjoying it a lot. He's dead, Jim. You rescued the mother ship's memory. It's no use in this condition, though. Let's repair it. Any spelling errors in there? You rescued the mother ship's memory. 
I didn't see one. We might be alright. Stick his eyes on. Life is pain. You could play £700 for a shiny. Ow. Hit the table. I don't have to do it this aggressively, but I feel as though it doesn't listen to me when I do it in the, a light way. Ugh. 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 It's fine. We did it. Yay, we fixed it. Sorry, I'm yawning. How rude of me. How rude of me. I'm so sorry. Look at that. Wow. That's going to ram it in a hole. Oh no, I have to put it in that one. Ouchie, my fingers hurt. You hit my fingers with a hammer. So mean. So mean. My fingers. We got a bunch of boys. A bunch of homies. 41 homies. Annoying about the one. Wish we only had 40. That would have been more satisfying. You rescued your first bot. Many more are scattered across the universe. So search every planet and try to rescue them all. I can't remember who said about the uh, spelling error. It doesn't look like this one. Unless I'm being dyslexic. You rescued your first bot. You! It says your! I found it. I found the spelling error. You rescued your first spot. I just filled it in because that's how my brain works. Your rescued your first spot. Your rescued your first spot! That's okay. These things happen. I misspell things all the time. And people always make fun of me about it. <laughs> yeah. The gacha lab is open. Time to spend all those coins you've collected. Kablamo! It's been a crash. <laughs> you did spell in general correctly, that's so true. It's got you there. Being Astrobot's friend is like being fine with either being having your head directly in the mouth of a bird or being fine with him standing directly on your head. There's no in between. You have to agree to both. Free these boys! Yay! They're part of the gang now. Another one. DJ Khaled. Oh, we haven't got 50 boys. I need, oh, we've got 30. Just bully them. See how they get on there. I'm building up character. Oh my gosh! It's Spyro! Everyone's favourite dragon. From Dragon Ball Z, of course. Friends with Goku, Spyro the dragon. Get down, idiot. It's Simon! Spyro? Is Spyro the dragon? Horrible, sorry. Oh, I've got a trophy. Slate. Oh, they're not doing it now because I knocked the wall down. Alright, sorry. Won't do it again. Whee! 
It's Frodo the dragon. And this one is... Bit of lint. Bit of lint from our favourite favorite game, Washing Machine Cleaning Simulator. Stupid, stupid joke. It's a dream come true. Finally, the representation Bit of Lint deserves. We don't talk about Bit of Lint enough, you know. I can't bother. To, I don't think I can get that without a hundred people anyway. Bit of Lint up of the PS5 fan. <laughs> Yeah, bit of lint does sound like a next indie game that pops up. It's true. Like I am bread, but you play as a bit of lint. <laughs> it's Squidland. We're going off to Squidland. Ah, oh, it gave him a mouth. That's nice. Reminds me of a rabbit. Oh, I want to do the mouth level, which I think is... I want to say this one is the mouse level. Oh, no, 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 this one. Okay. We'll go to the crab level and then we can do the mouse level. And that's one of my favourite levels. Meow. We're in the Go Go Archipelago! Archipelago! Die. Die. This one's Archie from the Archipelago. He was having a nice meal, but he's got to come into the hot tub now. Oh no! Some ugly guy! flipping goo boy I don't know what this game is bringing out of me she's she's got weird energy this girl who's doing the stream today weird vibes coming from her freedom I went to school with the archi with archipelago that's crazy I went to school with an archipelago too it was a common name you are cowabunga, dude. I don't know. It's a big boy. Time to die, loser. Got his ass. Got his ass. See you later, Drew. Hope you're having a good rest of your day. I mean, you're even talking to yourself in the third person forgetting your own name at the same time. <laughs> I, right. This is the, the one power-up I really hate. I hated it in Astro's Playroom, and I hate it in this as well. It annoys me, and I'm not very good at it. Oh, it's back. Good. Yeah, I I hate this in the last one. Thankfully, I think it's only this level that you have to do. If, if I'm remembering correctly, I'm pretty sure it's just this level. Which, thank God, it's so annoying. I hated it. Die. Yay! 
Yay! Damn it, I fell. Hold on. I've got to clamber my way back up there. Ugh. Look, some, some, uh, the Bride of Frankenstein or something. Absolutely shaking ass. It's the Bride of Frankenstein. Here. This doesn't even look like the Bride of Frankenstein. That is a bad one. She was just wearing a white dress. That's the kind of joke my dad would make. Sorry about that. I only apologise for the state of that joke. They can't all be good. So true. So true, bestie. That one was that one was the, the stinker. A real stinker on that one. Let's see if we can think of something better. Hmm. The Bride of Frankenstein is my favourite PlayStation game. To be fair. Well, then there we are. That one was just that was just for you. That was just for you. The thing is as well, like, I do recognise like some of these characters. It's not even that like I don't, I've never seen them before. I just, I cannot put a name to their face like when we're playing this this game because they don't look like themselves properly. So I'm like, I know you, but I don't know you. You are a stranger to me, but you look, you have my friend's face. <laughs> it's kind of the vibes of uh, of some of the. I'm like, I recognise your face, but like, I don't know you. And it's freaking me out. Pack it in. Bonk. Presents. This is like Adam Sandler in that big T-shirt. That's just Adam Sandler with a with horns on. Um, I recognise your face, but I don't know you. Has more Stepford Wives vibes to me. I recognise series at least a few times. Other times and some, other times names and some I don't recognise at all. It's I could no, that's Adam Sandler. What are you talking about? It's Adam Sandler in his new movie Bull in a China Shop, which sound, does kind of sound like an Adam Sandler movie. Where he wears a big T-shirt and big shorts, and he wears a ball head. I wonder how that Funko Pop game is going to do. Oh yeah, that's out really soon. It'll be interesting to see how it does. I don't think, I don't imagine it's going to be that good, to be honest. We rescued all the bots. I may have two real stinker of a pretend, pretend knowing ones. coming oh lord he's coming i 
Funko game. I mean, I have 70 Funkos, but that sounds awful. If you've not seen it, it's called Funko Fusion. And it's like a Lego game in that it's set over a bunch of different worlds and it's got different characters because obviously there's all kinds of Funkos of different things. I don't actually really know how they've got the rights to do this uh, for this Funko game, but alas, they do. Um, so, yeah, check it out if you... I mean... If you like Lego games, I don't imagine it's going to be any worse than a Lego game. I just don't think it's going to have quite the charm that this has, for example. But you can play as like, what was this? It's got like Hot Fuzz. I can't even remember what it's. Hot Fuzz and then like a bunch of other random ones too. It looks like a Lego game, but not as good, yeah. Yeah! <laughs> I hate this flipping monkey, and I can't wait to never have to see you do it again. Sup, homies? Eh, eh, eh. Of all the characters in the Funko games, uh, Universal Pitch Pop is the base of the characters limited. That's true. We're fighting a big pirate and we died. That's fine. $50 redo. Is it 50 quid? God, I didn't know that. But it's going to be so good. It's going to be so good. Yeah. We did it. Get down here, you coward. Yeah. Oh no, see, why did you do that for? Yeah. Happy 420 BBBB blazing, my dude's Lord 16 dab. Here are some Robert jokes for Astro Robert and his mm -hmm. new game. What do you call a robot crab that has fallen into disrepair? A rustation. Ha ha ha. What would you call a Texas robot? Tex Mex. Ha -e. What Android team won the Olympic water? That's very good. The robots. Ho ho ho. What does R2D2 use to open PDF files? Adobe One Kenobi. Ha ooh ooh. <laughs> what musical instrument do robots play? Cyborgans. Hi who? Where do robots sit? On their robotoms. Ha we. Robotoms is very funny. Thank you for the blips, LB, and the jokes. Some very good ones in there. I'll take you down the other exit today. I'll take you around the back and I'll show you the exit out the back. Yeah, the fire yeah. exit. In case there's a fire. B B B B B B B Astro B B B B B B Bot B B B B B B Monkey B B B B B B B P S five B B B B B B B B Pro B B B B B B B seven hundred quid B B B B B B B B Astro Bot is better than PS five Pro Blaze it. Thank you for the blip, Steve. I'm I've just received Steven, sorry. I just we have some formal with you calling you Steve. Just realized there's a bunch of PlayStation trophies in here, that's fun. That is what I like to call fun. Yeah, it has got big Lego Dimensions vibes, you're right. I don't know if someone calls me Steve, I just want to either. Okay, that's fine. My dad goes by Steve and his name is Steven. So, just want to assume, you know, so formal and rude of me. It's still a lost galaxy like I was telling you about. And, I, and I two levels in each thing have a lost galaxy one that have more people in them. But we'll go back because I want to do the mouse one. I want to do the mouse one. So we're going to do the mouse one. Come on. Give me that fucking mouse one. Yes. The best one. I hate when people call me Steve. Is it because it's just not your name? I hate when people call me Ash. Have I told you about this? About how someone keeps calling me Ash and I don't know how to tell them that th that's not my name. It's been too long now. Yeah. 
Look, we be little mouse. We little mouse, and we jump on flower pots. Isn't that lovely? Oh, it's so cute. So good, so cute. Love it. Ash is precisely half my name, exactly. Sorry, Ash. You flipping will be. I just realised... So, someone keeps calling me Ash, and I may have told... If I told the story, please stop me. Uh, good luck. <laughs> good luck stopping me talking. Sorry. Uh, but someone in my life recently has started calling me Ash all the time. And I have no issue with that. I just... No one else calls me Ash. Uh, and I don't really like it. And um, so he kept calling me Ash and then I would not respond because I didn't realise he was talking to me. <laughs> I didn't know he was talking to me. So I would just ignore him. And then he'd be like, Ash. And then I was like, oh, he must... I'll just respond because no one else is. And then, <laughs> and then at one point he said something and I was like, oh, that's what I'm doing. And then I realised he was talking about me. And I was like, oh my god, I'm the worst person in the world. And I hadn't realised. But by that point, it's already too late, you know. And we're in deep. I can't be like, um, actually, um, that's not really my name. So now, it's just Ash for the foreseeable. Pete and Ash, best friends. Pete and Ash, best friends. Two best friends, Pete and Ash. Me and my homies, Pete and Ash. Watch out. Kablam! Freedom. And and B. Yeah, exactly. Ash, Pete, and B. Who's screaming? What's that noise? Hello, little mouse. At least it's not Ashley. That's true. That is absolutely not my name. So Ash left him, Ton is not yet. Yeah, Ton's fine. I actually, I love Ton. That's what all my, my best, my mum calls me that. She says, oh, here's Ton. Here's Ton again. And I'm like, yeah, here I am. Hey, little mouse. I so small, little mouse. Die. Ashley, Pierre, and Bernard. Exactly. Oh, Bernard. Someone has asked me in the past my name is short for something and then spent an uncomfortable amount of time trying to think of what it could be. I guess you could be like, oh yeah, Chip is short for Christopher. But like, I'd be like... If you said, oh yeah, Chip is short for Christopher, you're going to tell me it is now and I'm going to feel really embarrassed. But I'd be like... Well, I just feel like maybe we're we're trying to be different a bit too much, you know. I feel like I feel like Christopher is the shortened version of or Chris is the shortened version of Christopher. And I feel like you can't just decide not to use that word. So get out of bed. We've got stuff to do. Chip is short for chips. <laughs> Chip is short for chips and dips is so funny. Chip and dips. Oh, yeah, brilliant. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. And a mouse, best friends, till one of them eats the other one. Oh, we've missed one. That's okay. We'll get over it. We don't need them all, Ashton. We're just here to have a good time. How dare you? 
MB's name is, is just Ben. He tells everyone it's Benjamin, but that's a lie. It's just Ben. He was christened Ben, you know? His parents did not give him a full name. Oh, oh that's fine. I can get back up from here. Mouse. The M in MV stands for mm, just Ben. <laughs> that is so stupid. It's like I came up with it myself. Oh, look, it's a Teletubby. My favourite character from video games is the Teletubby with the big head. Big headed Teletubby, that's what they call him. They say, uh oh, watch out, here comes the big headed Teletubby. Telehead, yeah. He's the he's the rare the rare spotted Teleheady is what he is. Right, you guys ready for this? I don't really understand how it works. I don't know how it knows that I'm blowing into it. But it does. What is the science behind it? Tell me now. You're free. The secret exit's up there, but we're not going out the secret exit. We're carrying on. Science can't answer anything. Maybe it's magic. Nah, doesn't seem right. Just the mic. Nah, doesn't seem right. <laughs> I know it's the mic. I just like the idea that it knows specifically if you're blowing. Like, if you if you talk into it, it's not going to work. But It's like you have to blow. Anything other than blowing doesn't work. Can't suck. You have to blow. And that's like some pretty cool science that they figured out. Oh my gosh. It's Peter Rabbit. Love Peter Rabbit. Never stinker again. Better than flipping Bride of Frankenstein. That was bad. Never came up with that one. Terrible. Terrible suggestion. Oh, everything in me is what's going to get that, but we don't need it. We don't need it. We don't need it. Quill from Moss? Nah, no, it doesn't seem right. It's Peter Rabbit. <laughs> that was a close one, wasn't it? I didn't even mean to swear. But it was really close to being a swear. I just misspoke. <laughs> right, don't mess this up, Matthews. Did we even do it on the last one? No, we left through the secret exit. Boy. Three quarters of the swear, I know. It was really close. I just, like, my mouth got mixed up. So, I nearly said the F word. Sorry. Stop yawning. You, you stop yawning. I'm trying to do a stream here. Stop yawning. You're making me yawn. It's obviously all your fault. <laughs> the trunk of funk. The trunk of funk. Frogs. Yeah, I almost said Fortnite. <laughs> Not Fortnite. Uh. Just killed all of those rabbits. They just all died. Well, I just yawned. That. See, it's your fault that I yawned. I wouldn't have yawned if you hadn't yawned. Look, a nice flower. 
going to do nothing. you got to smack this one. She's just here for to look pretty. Why did I think Blowing was going to do something on that one? She kind of looks like a fan. Bitch! Bitch! Now all the thingies have respawned. Die. And you. You can absolutely die. Boing. Oh no, a big flower. An evil one. You flip in mind. present for me the present is the, the fruit of life water there's a cow love him michael on a beer <laughs> what's about this one she just said to look free ashton 2024 that's some right stinkers coming out of this stream aren't we real bad vibes from ashton on this stream I'm gonna kill this mole. I'm gonna kill this mole. Come on then, idiot. Come out of the ground. I've got to save Avril Lavigne's skater boy. Just because you're dressed like a Pikmin doesn't mean I'll forgive you. Water. Water. Piss. So close. Yeah. Go. Look, they're all feeding him so slowly with their little buckets of water. These poor little ants. We'll help him grow big and strong by drowning him. Love this song. Let's crank it. Trunk of funk. You thought they were a pair of boobs, Chip. Got boobs on the brain. He wants us to jump into his mouth. He wants us to jump into his mouth. Yes, sing it, trunk of funk. This level just just vibes. set and tap this year we are it will open in october november time uh we will be doing a tap heel again this year as normal all tat is appreciated i love this tree the vibes of this tree are immaculate. Uh-oh. 
I've got a bottle opener to send you. Stunning news. Die! We'll suck your brains up. Otherwise they come back to life. tree is sexy <laughs> this tree is so hot this tree flips big time I'm doing it again aren't I saying the weird thing it's got such a sexy voice Where is the light? Exactly, there's no light. This tree is fit as. Have you considered the tree is just like really, really sexy? Have you considered that? Have you factored in the sexiness of the tree? I don't know if it, if it even sounds good because I don't know if all you can hear is the music, but I'm actually fine with you just hearing the tree and me in the background. Rescued Martin. Hope he's not a dad, you might kill him. I guess trees sort of are dads because they have all those sea things, don't they? So I guess he kind of probably is a dad. And therefore he must. Oh, he died. Therefore he must die. This is one of those streams that is making me sad. Stream highlight of the week is no longer a thing. <laughs> tree and a daddy tree love each other very much. A baby tree is born, indeed. <laughs> wood, or rather, wood. I'm just winking. Doing my sexy wink. I don't just have an eye twitch, so there. Help me. ones are so aggressive. For why? For what reason? Yay, prison. You can still clip your favourite moments on Twitch or YouTube, this is true. And it will... I think, well, we'll be able to see them, but... So will other people.
We lived, bitch. Give me that soul of yours to suck up. No. Rip Twitch stream highlight of the week, indeed. Rip Twitch stream highlight of the week, you would have loved this Astro Box stream. He's still singing this sexy tree. I can't deal with it, he's just too sexy. No one at Asobi thought about this when they made this tree, they, no, one thought, no one's got to consider just because we can, whether we should, make this tree so sexy. No one thought about it. The trauma trio's here. And then idiots. Suck their flipping brains out. Sorry, sorry. That's a bit of a horrible noise there, isn't it? Annihilated! Killed him, got them, died. Yeah, the whole gang's so excited. Do we get all the boys? Oh my god, guys, we missed someone. Can we go back down? We can't. That's okay. I just have to be fine with it. No, they are babies. Well, they are. They are. The, they were the trauma. The trauma trio. We just gave them a bit more trauma to deal with. Because they're all dead now. <laughs> Sorry. I oh, know that tree can lay some mad root. Oh dear. What have we done? What have we done? Let's do this retro rampage DOS. I kill dads and babies. I'll give everyone... I'm an equal opportunity woman. I'll kill dads, I'll kill babies. I'll kill mums if I really have to. It wouldn't be preferable though, I'd rather kiss mums. You know, if, if, if a mum needed to die, I'll kill a mum. Good. She looks nice. In her pajamas. Kill dad's kiss mum's t-shirt. Exactly. That's a good one. We should make that. Something to do with some worms. I'm here to kill worms and kiss mums. And I'm all out of mums. It's punching time. <laughs> Quick pick. Stunning. Go out of your mouth, you sick flex. Oh my gosh, guys. It's Phoebe Bridges. I'm absolutely steamrolling for this. It's might not even be a good viewing experience because I'm not even letting you see what's going on. I'm just like, next. Next thing. for him, was it?
Get my fist out of your mouth, you sick flips. Sick freaks. Wait here for the vibes, I think. Cool. <laughs> cool. Because it's not going to be the fantastic commentary and the uh, quality game. Even though I am kind of playing this like queen. Okay, well, why did you throw me the wrong way? It's a bit upsetting to me. I think it was my fault, but still. Come on then. No, you. Marianne, get off there. Is that Tonky Hanks? I think that's Tony Hawk. That's crazy. What's he doing there? We're <laughs> here for the vibes. Get my fist out of your mouth. Good vibes. Yeah, that's what I thought. And you, fist out of mouth now. I'm double fisting. Get out. Get out of the ground. Oh gosh. The big boy wants two fists in his mouth. You're welcome, moles. And what goes out to all you moles out there? PlayStation Zone Tonky Honk, exactly. Tonky Honk, pro boy. I was about to get two fists in his mouth. Shout out to my moles. Shake your hands if you're a mole. Big up my mole brethren. Where are my moles at? It's a crunchy nut cornflakes guy. A fungus head. fun guys fisting in the bomb <laughs> but that guy loves it loves it uh oh I know a big worm I got ate by a big worm nightmare hate when that happens mulched and Matthew that's what they call me that's what they call me huge in the mole community I am moles love me mums love me dads want to be me mole dads want to be me especially you can't handle me at my mole list Ciao. Yeah, mums love me dads fear me oh! <laughs> I didn't turn it back down after the flipping tree stopped singing. Get it out! We can hear moles on the other side of the bomb basement wall sometimes. They love it. They all come out scratching. They can't see me, but they love hearing me. <laughs> Party! Uh, 
just gonna make you all jealous. I've just eaten my tea, a homemade veggie toad in the hole with Heinz beans. Yep, sorry to make you all feel like you don't measure up, but you know, I'm just baller like that. Oh my god, a veggie toad in the hole with beans. I have to say, and not to be rude, but beans on a toad in the hole sounds flipping disgusting. Sounds wet and gross. <laughs> like, you do you, hun. Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me eating beans on my food like that. Toad of the beans. Beans in the hole. Exactly. Couldn't, could not be me. <laughs> Is that what the moles are eating? Yeah. Moles in the holes. Wet and gross like the creamy canyon earlier. <laughs> yeah! That's disgusting. Just like the creamy canyon. Come on! Well, you're very wrong. You do have to be careful not to have a greasy Yorkshire pud, but boy, it's good. I thought people, and like, I don't like gravy, so again, couldn't be me. But I thought people had um, gravy on their toes in the hole. Is that not the customary experience? What do I have when I have toad in the hole? I don't think I have toad in the hole very often, but I feel like if I was going to have it, I'd just have it with peas. But what would I have as a sauce? Maybe I wouldn't have a sauce. Maybe I feel like it should speak for itself. I'm not a big Yorkshire pudding gal, you know. Just don't love them. I feel like they're often a bit too dry for me. <laughs> Probably my issue is that I don't have any sauce. Now that could be part of the problem here, but it doesn't seem likely that I'm the problem. Doesn't seem like I could be in the wrong here. Oh. Sorry, sounds so American, but toad in the hole sounds wild. It's um sausages in Yorkshire pudding. You cook the Yorkshire pudding around the sausages so they're like peeking through. But it's it's just sausage and Yorkshire pudding, which is just pancake batter but cooked differently. Imagine, if you will, a sausage. Uh, smothered in pancake and that's what toad in the hole is as god intended i am hating on the north it's true sounds delicious people love it love it you need to add beans then americans don't know what yorkshire pudding is i'm just what i'm saying a yorkshire pudding is pancakes but cooked differently like it's a bit it's like um you 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 cook oil you put it in hot oil so it all puffs up and then it goes it's like a pancake <laughs> but not but not a pancake i don't know how how would you describe yorkshire pudding how would you describe yorkshire pudding i think the apple mentioned jealousy toad in the hole is amazing i'm not saying there's anything wrong well with toad in the hole i'm just saying it's not really my bag that's all i'm saying delicious it's really not it's not like a pancake but it's pancake batter but cooked differently it's not like a pancake <laughs> why do i not know how to describe what flipping toad in the hole is man why has that suddenly become a massive issue for me the yorkshire pudding i don't know how to describe a yorkshire pudding it's really upsetting me that I don't know how to describe a Yorkshire pudding properly. How sad. They've just left me behind. Come back here. Left me, abandoned me. I'm also struggling to describe Yorkshire pudding. Yeah, see, this is what I'm saying. It's difficult to describe what a Yorkshire pudding is. Should we spend the last few minutes of the stream just discussing what a Yorkshire pudding is? Hold on, let me... I'll show you a picture of a Yorkshire pudding. Yorkshire pudding. It's mint, that was what it is. Yeah. I like Aunt Bessie's Yorkshire puddings the most, which is probably sacrilege, but... I'm fine with that. Right, window capture... There we go, I've just got to add a new thingy. Right, ignore. This is Yorkshire pudding. No, just 
Make the picture bigger. These are Yorkshire puddings. These are the kind of ones I like. Uh, I don't really like them when they're like this because I feel like they're a bit too bitter on the top. Do you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But these ones, these ones I can get behind. They're small. They're a bit like Aunt Bessie's. Also famous. You can get a Yorkshire pudding. You can make a Yorkshire pudding big enough to put your whole roast dinner in. Um, oftentimes at Christmas markets nowadays, you'll see like a Yorkshire pudding wrap. Uh, but yeah, that's what they look like. You know, it says, it says gravy Yorkshire pudding. I'm going to type in Yorkshire pudding and beans. That is disgusting. Oh my God. I didn't think I'd have this visceral of a reaction to it. That's gross. That is so gross. I'll show you toad in the hole as well. Toad in the hole. This is what Toad in the Hole looks like. That's not really a good one, though. Like, this is where you kind of want some onions in there. <laughs> I can't go over that. Horrible baked beans. That was, oh, that really made me actually feel sick. Anyway, that's what Yorkshire pudding is. It's, I realised it was above my camera the whole time. Sorry about that. <laughs> I didn't realise. I didn't realise it was in front of my camera. Um, Sorry about that. Anyway. Thanks for joining me today for this stream. I uh, hope you've had a good time. I certainly have. That game is so great, man. I love Astro Bot. I think it's a brilliant game and I would, I've, I have played lots of it this week. I don't know, I mean, we can play it again next week, but I don't want to spoil the whole game for you. So maybe we'll do one more stream or maybe we'll move on to Plucky Squire next week because uh, maybe that'd be a bit easier. Um, anyway, thanks for hanging out with me, everyone. Hope you had a good day. I'll be back tomorrow on the joint stream. I'm not sure what me and Peter are playing yet, but I'm sure we'll um, we'll figure that out tomorrow. Um, but yeah, have a wonderful rest of your day. I'm going to send you over to hang out with OC, who is playing some Balatro. Balatro. I don't know how you say it. Anyway, um, head on over there. Be nice. Say nice things. Be kind. Show, uh, you're wearing your triple jump uniform, so make sure you behave correctly out in the community so everyone knows how nice you all are. Um, <laughs> but yeah, thank you for hanging out with me. I'll see you all next week if I don't see you tomorrow. And yeah, that's about it. All right, love ya. Bye.